For the second day, second day today, hundreds more will be getting COVID-19 vaccinations at the Prime Osborne Convention Center. Today's shots will once again be limited to those who are 65 and older and frontline workers who work directly with patients. News for Jackson reporter Zach Lajway joins us live from outside the Convention Center. Zach, the county says it will be adding more appointments later this week. Yes, and for many, Jen, this is really great news. According to the health department, later this week, Thursday at 5 o'clock in the afternoon, you will see more appointments become available on their system on the internet. Again, this is happening Thursday at 5, and this dump, if you will, will take place every Thursday from here on out. To book one of the appointments that will be opening Thursday, you'll need to go to duval.floridahealth.gov. According to the health department, this is where additional time slots will open. Jacksonville Mayor Lenny Curry also said additional vaccination locations will be coming online soon. Right now, 900 vaccines can be administered each day at Prime Osborne Convention Center. Curry says the plan is to keep it this way for three weeks. By week four, the city hopes to increase that number to 1,600 doses a day, as well as rolling out the second dose for those who have received their first dose. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis also announcing four new actions the state is taking that he says will proactively increase vaccinations throughout all 67 counties. They are expanding access to the vaccine by adding additional state supported sites. DeSantis has directed state emergency officials to identify COVID-19 testing sites that can convert to vaccine sites deploying the vaccine to underserved communities, reinforcing efforts with additional staff and continuing to prioritize long term care facility residents. The new appointments opening on Thursday will be for next week. You might recall all the appointments for this week have already been spoken for. Right now, the city has a total of 39,000 vaccines. This is of both the Pfizer vaccine and the Moderna vaccine. It's unclear how many vaccines they will receive next week. Reporting live in downtown Jacksonville, I'm Zach Lazarus, Channel 4, the local station.